Scooter vs. Motorcycle Scooter and motorbike are both two-wheel drives between which there are certain differences that are important to know. So, let's get started. Number 1. Transmission. The main difference between scooters and motorcycles is the transmission. Scooters have always had automatic transmission, which makes them generally more attractive to beginner drivers. The motorcycles operate at 4 to 6 speeds, and they use a lever located on the left handlebar to switch between different speeds. Number 2. Size. Scooters are generally smaller than an average motorcycle in both engine size and appearance even if there is room for more than one passenger. Scooters are more designed for alternative roads and small smooth streets, generally at speeds less than 70 km per hour. Body styles often have smoother, more rounded lines than motorcycles. Number 3. Loading Capacity Most scooters are designed for one person only, although larger models have room for two. Motorcycles generally have room for two people, one in front and one behind. Larger bikes have the ability to even tow small trailers over greater distances, while scooters don't. Motorcycles can have a sidecar attached, while scooters cannot. Number 4. Get on. Motorcycle riders get on the motorcycle when standing to your left, take the handlebars, and pass the right leg over the body. Feet are located to the left and right of the body on pegs or platforms. Scooters always have a structure to stand on and a platform on the bike to put your feet. This is the big visual difference between the two. Number 5. Cost Effectiveness. Scooters generally have better gas mileage than motorcycles simply because their engines are smaller and less powerful. These can be located anywhere between 30 and 42 kilometers per liter. Motorcycles vary between 17 and 30 kilometers per liter. The bigger the motor size, lower the kilometers per liter. In general it is cheaper to buy scooters than motorcycles, 